hopefully it's not delayed it's gonna be the first so keep your fingers crossed will it be extra virgin olive oil with hot jalapeno peppers or will it be in zesty tomato sauce I got a sequence yesterday from Rhoda D gave me a Tampa layover today you guys so the sequence goes from how does it go okay today I got two legs Boston to Charlotte Charlotte to Tampa and I have 15 hours of layover in Tampa then tomorrow, Tampa to DFW, DFW Boston. That's pretty much it, you guys. Super, super simple. I've done this sequence before. Uh, this time I'm going to be number one, so that's cool. Extra ka ching, ka ching. So when you're number one, you get a little bit of extra pay. But um, yeah, that's awesome. All right, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and drive. It's 2.09 and the bus leaves at 2.30. So I wanted to leave at 2 o'clock, but my scarf today is not cooperating with me. So I hope that looks okay. <laughs> um, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great morning. Mwah. Hey you guys, guess who I met here? Hi, Hi good morning. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> It is almost 2 o'clock p.m. right now in Tampa, Florida. That's right. I am here. 15-hour layover here in Tampa. So without further ado, let's start with our room tour. Let's go. As soon as you enter the door, on your left side, you'll see a mirror with a lamp right there. And on the right hand side you'll see tons of mirrors again it's a bathroom right there bum 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 and shower room boom super simple nothing fancy extra towels down there more towels some art and me <laughs> all right let's move on entering the room this is a closet boom close the closet and this is the bed side Boom, two beds. I think that's queen size beds. I think my guess is queen size. And we got more arts right there. They give you some water. Look at that, I like it. I like water. All right, I didn't see any microwave or maybe it's somewhere in here, let's see. Oh, we got fridge here. I didn't see this. Oops. <laughs> Why is that? You gotta open it wide to open it. Boom, let's turn this baby on. Cause I'm gonna put my food in here. How do you turn it on? I don't even know, seriously. How do you even turn it on? Okay, 
I'm guessing it will be like that. We'll see if it gets cold. All right, these are just, yeah, I thought it was microwave. No, I don't need that. I don't have anything to, to put in there. Oh, I guess you can put your passport or something. Woo! This is coffee maker. All right, you do it like that. I guess a double coffee maker. What kind of coffee they give you? Mmm, but that. They always have ice bucket, but you never need it. I never need it. Not yet. Maybe when I go on vacation. All right. Where's no microwave? No microwave, you guys. So I gotta use my Hot Logic Pro. So that is the full cabinet right there. I didn't realize that's a fridge. And this is a little desk area. Boom. But um boom. Alright. Little area for reading. That's pretty much it, you guys. And the ventilation, which I always check, it's right there. And the settings is perfect for now. 65, I like that another art piece there you go you guys that's pretty much the whole entire room right there boom boom now let's check the outside I haven't checked this one yet let's see what we got going on here whoa not much just the view of the other side of the building <laughs> so Nah, nothing much. Just some trees down there. Not a great view, but I got the sky here. I'm okay with that. Alright you guys, that's pretty much it for now and I'm gonna go get some rest, I guess. I'm not really that tired for some reason. I didn't get a lot of sleep but I don't feel tired so I think I'm gonna go change to a gym outfit right now because if I do it now, I will most likely go to the gym. If I'm not, I will just fall asleep. So I'm gonna go ahead and change and go to the gym and then come back here and eat and sleep that's pretty much what i'm planning on doing all right i'll see you guys at the gym all right you guys look what i got here my hot logic mini so i just put this here it's what time is it now i can't even tell 2 30 there you go. It's 2.35. Almost 2.35. So I'm not even going to time this. I'm just going to leave this here. I usually put a timer, but I'll check it, um, I don't know, in an hour or so and when I feel like it's hot. So it's going to take a while because this rice and spinach are very cold. <laughs> so it's in my cooler, my lunch box, uh, lunch bag. So I'm just going to leave that there, sealed it, and, and just call that a day. I'll come back to you later. I know, what's that red thing on my face? I just washed my face and then it's hot in here. It says 65, but the room it says 70 something. It's very hot. And my allergy, it's kind of hard to breathe when it's like too hot. I know. I know, I grew up in Philippines, but I can't like handle like too hot. See, it's 65, but the room is 73 degrees. Oh, that's why I watched that. 
Let's see, the room is 73, set to 65, but it's 73, maybe, see? Oh, it's not doing anything. It's been 65 for a while. So anyways, I don't know. Um, I ended up not going to the gym because I was feeling dizzy a while ago. I don't know why, maybe because I only had like three hours of sleep last night. So I just ended up staying here on my bed, see my computer. I've been editing for a couple of hours. I didn't notice the time. It's 4.20 already, is it? Last time I looked was 2.35. It's 4.20, yeah. So I'm gonna go check my food. I think this is probably super hot now. <laughs> it's just steaming it, so it's not like gonna burn it or anything, you know? Ooh, I can feel that. Hold on, start to open it with one thing. Ooh, it's Let's see, I got my spoon here. Let's see if it's hot in the middle. Do you see it? If it's steaming. Should be steaming now. Oh, definitely ready. Definitely. See my spinach is it's wilted already. A little bit almost overcooked spinach right there. But it's okay. I can still eat that. I'm just gonna have this with my usual sardines. I've been like into sardine craziness. I love it. So I'm gonna go grab my sardines. Let's go get that right here hello <laughs> I think I put it somewhere here don't even remember where I put it but I know I have it Oops. that's hot sauce there we go I got soup as well for later Let's see chicken sausage gumbo I just had that like two days ago at home and here I got different kinds of sardines. Will it be extra virgin olive oil with jalapeno peppers? Or will it be in zesty tomato sauce? Mm -hmm. I'll take this one. This is for later. This one and hot sauce. There you go. that one so this one doesn't have a switch so you just kind of remove the plug and voila it's done so I am just gonna whew, it's kind of hot huh? it's hot we are gonna eat before we continue editing I need a little break I didn't realize it was almost two hours when I was eating this no wonder the spinach is all and a two voltage. Sorry, my head is like. All right. Easy open can. Boom. No splash. It is said, please don't splash. All right, we're gonna leave it like that. The last time I opened it thoroughly, it just splashes, splashes all over me. All right. Thank you po sa pagkain. Maraming salamat po. Alright, let's eat. I know, start with hot sauce right away. Uh, I forgot to bring vinegar again. Oh, you guys. I think I'm going to put the hot sauce. I don't know. I'm just going to just put it in my rice. Get it all done. And then, ah, not all of it. <laughs> Sardines, can you see it? Hmm? You got this. You've seen this before. That's what I'm gonna have. Sardines. I like this because it's easy to pack. I didn't have to cook, you know. I wish I did. I wish I didn't have time to cook better. Um, I kind of miss um, eating home cooked meals. Dad has been cooking at home, but I haven't been. <laughs> Dad means Papa, means Daryl, means my sweetheart. You know what I'm saying? Eat kind of All right, you guys, this is hot. I can feel it. 
better be hot. It's been sitting there for two hours. Oh yeah, it's actually really hot. It is perfect. Hot logic. <laughs> it's super hot. Can't take it out. It's just all full of like steam around the yeah, hot logic. Just condensation. You can see how how long it's been sitting here. <laughs> I'm not gonna put hot sauce in this one. It's a little bit spicy already. I don't want to go crazy with the hot sauce, which I have been. Cheers, you guys. Kain po. All right, you guys. I'm gonna go enjoy my chicken gumbo something soup. You guys have a great night. I'm gonna get at least eight hours of sleep. Yeah, hey. Look at the elevator. This is so cool. I like this elevator yeah. a lot. It's 4.40ish. We are here at the lobby at the hotel. Super early. <laughs> guys this is it last leg keep your fingers crossed seems like every time I'm here in DFW it's always delayed so today hopefully it's not delayed this is gonna be the first so keep your fingers crossed right now it's still on time and they're deplaning now and then we're gonna hop in there and leave hopefully in time so it's not delayed we are here on 575. Look at this. Alright, you guys, this is a good sign because we are in the plane and I hope it's not going to be delayed because every time, every single time, and DFW is delayed. So, but I'm feeling really optimistic right now because we're already inside the plane. They're cleaning it, they're getting it ready, and bank, we're not going to be delayed for the very first time from DFW. Yay! Alright you guys, I finished uh, pretty much uh, no first time, no delay. Very first time. No delay. Hold on. I'm i I'm definitely like um, shaking right now, so I'll talk to you when I get back downstairs. Alright you guys, I have some time here to kill. It is two 50 p.m. right now Boston time and I'm actually in Boston Logan right here <laughs> so look it's so quiet here just pretty much uh, got here about I don't know what time did I get here 40 minutes ago the only thing that kind of sucks with taking the bus is I have to wait until the bus gets here and it's not gonna get here for another 20 minutes I got here about 40 minutes ago and there is no bus until every 10 minute of the hour so I kind of passed the 210 bus so I'm waiting for the 310 bus uh, usually it gets to terminal 8 by 310 and it will be here by maybe around 315 we'll see yeah just got nothing to do I don't really want to edit here I don't have enough time to edit but Kind of getting bored so finally I i'm here in new hampshire it's super hot you guys it is 90 degrees fahrenheit in dover right now and it's what time is it 5 34 p.m so wow that was a very very long bus ride it was traffic. I think I fell asleep. I didn't even see the traffic, but I'm pretty sure it was traffic because it's supposed to be. I think I'm supposed to be here by five o'clock. I don't remember, but anyways, I didn't realize it's 5:34 p.m. already. But I'm just. Um, I know the car is super hot, so I'm just waiting it to cool off a little bit before I drive. Oh my gosh, so far hot, you guys. 90 degrees. Good <sighs> thing I'm wearing a short sleeves. 
anyways you guys I'm heading back home and Papa bought some lobster roll to make no I think it's already cooked he made uh, he bought some lobster and we're gonna make some uh, we're gonna have lobster roll tonight for dinner I haven't had it for a while and I am scheduled for wrap B tomorrow wrap B is 4 p.m. to 4 no sorry 4 a.m. to 4 p.m. so woo mate start at 4 a.m. <laughs> that means I'm on call from 4 a.m. to 4 p.m. I have a feeling I'm not gonna get any sequence tomorrow it's my last day before I get a day off so tomorrow is July 31st I do have a day off uh, on August 1st 2nd 3rd but I picked up a sequence on August 2nd and 3rd I think it's a two-day sequence I don't remember but anyways, um, I'll see you guys later.